Somewhere along its 1400 kilometre journey across Western Australia, this tiny capsule disappeared. It had been packed by a, a specialised team. But somehow got out of its packaging and fell out of a small hole in the truck left by a loose bolt. If somebody were to discover it somewhere along the route, we are very keen that they do not handle it. The GPS shows us um, where the truck stopped, where it was overnight, and the rest stops. So they'll be checked um, on foot, more, more detailed, and the main road in between uh, using the specialist equipment that'll come. The capsule was packaged near Newman on the 10th of January and left the mine site between the 11th and the 14th. The package arrived in Perth on the 16th, unloaded and stored at a secured site. On January 25th, it was unpacked for inspection and it was discovered the capsule was missing. The Hazard Management Agency was informed that evening. Highly unusual. <laughs> it's left my head in a bit of a spin. This radiation safety expert says the way the capsule was lost is bizarre. Typically they're transported in highly protected casings. The housing is subjected to rigorous testing for vibrations, heat, uh, high impact. In a statement, Rio Tinto says the capsule was being transported by a contractor and it's working with authorities to assist in the search. The diameter of this five cent coin is more than three times the size of the missing radioactive capsule. And with such a vast expanse for authorities to cover, they've warned there is a possibility it might never be found. Kaysen Ho, ABC News.